A space is always new, a performer is always new, no matter whether that performer has done 20 years of theater or 20 years of circus, is always new, unknown, untouched when the performer enters my gaze or the spectator's gaze is always a new entity. I paint not with oil and brushes or, or crayons, but I paint with human beings. Space is dramaturgy. Space dictates the dramaturgy, the behavior of the performers, their memory and desire in that new encounter, which is, which is the, the now of the unfolding present. The famous energy of, uh, you know, the co-presence of performers and audience, and I, I, we all know, we all know and we all miss it, but however, it felt like it is not, um, this famous energy is not something that happens automatically. It is not only because people gather in the same space, in the same physical space, in order to have that energy, it has to be produced. Think of internet and social media as this place of viral circulations of information, uncontrolled information flow, um, um, a dangerous echo chamber of uh, rumors, of fake news, you know, I can't control if it's true or not anymore, of chats and tweets that are really highly infectious on an emotional level, you, you say things online you wouldn't say in a face-to-face -face situation. When I make the performance for, uh, for any audience that I claim, uh, how am I casting? Am I casting the artist or am I casting the device or the network that the artist is using, the actor is using while I'm making this kind of performances? The terrible, precarity of it all. With the precarity, the tendency of the spectator would be to withdraw into himself and close and watch from a sense of safety. When you talk of Corona Theatre, it, 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 it's, you have a live audience, but you also have this other audience. And what is the negotiation between these two audiences? And the spectator feels, in a sense, bound by so many restrictions that he or she is actually taking note of m many other things rather than the performance. Will this give the rulers an opportunity to shut down theatre which questions the system? Will this bring new mode of surveillance? And how will artists who, who are away from the digital space survive and continue with their art. So you don't give yourself to the performance. The alienation between the performance and the spectator grows larger and larger. <laughs> <laughs>